With just months to go until Apple's fall event, reports on everything from its design and camera to its hardware suggest that Apple is planning to make significant changes to the iPhone 15 series, especially to the iPhone 15 Pro Max. With so many conflicting rumors floating around, here's what we currently know about the upcoming iPhone 15 Pro Max. Several tipsters have hinted that the iPhone 15 Pro Max could feature a curved design and the same has been seen on the dummy units of the smartphone that have been leaked. It could also get curved bezels, according to Shrimp Apple Pro. The viewing area will remain flat, but the side bezels will be a lot slimmer and contained within the curve area to give a more bezel-less feel, like the display of the Apple Watch Ultra. According to 9to5Mac, the iPhone 15 Pro Max could also get the thinnest bezels of any smartphone around at just 1.55 millimeters. One of the biggest changes to come to the iPhone in recent years is the inclusion of the USB Type-C port that will replace Apple's proprietary Lightning port in accordance with EU regulations. According to a report, Apple could limit the charging speeds on third-party chargers and cables, only allowing MFI-certified accessories to take advantage of full charging speeds. Moreover, the iPhone 15 Pro Max is expected to get a titanium frame with haptic mute switch, and the same has been shown in renders of the smartphone. Another leak hints at a new action button, similar to the one found on the Apple Watch Ultra. The iPhone 15 Pro Max alongside the iPhone 15 Pro is expected to have the brand new A17 Bionic chipset, which could be based on the new 3NM process technology. Apple analyst Ming-Chi Kuo has said that only the iPhone 15 Pro and iPhone 15 Pro Max will get the A17 Bionic. The RAM is also expected to be bumped up to 8GB. The leaked benchmark scores for the iPhone 15 Pro Max show how much it could be faster than not only the iPhone 14 Pro Max, but also the flagship Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra. The iPhone 15 Pro Max gets a reported Geekbench 6 single-core score of 3019, while the iPhone 14 Pro Max and Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra achieved a score of 2523 and 2000, respectively. It has also been claimed that the iPhone 15 Pro Max will be equipped with Wi-Fi 6E, according to a McCruver's report, which has been backed up by analyst Ming-Chi Kuo. Reports reveal that the iPhone 15 Pro Max is expected to get the same camera system as its predecessor, including the 48-megapixel Sony IMX803 sensor. On the other hand, it reportedly gets a new periscope lens. According to a report by McCroomers, the periscope camera on the iPhone 15 Pro Max could have almost doubled the optical zoom as the current iPhones. Just a few weeks ago, Apple analyst Ming-Chi Kuo revealed that Apple had chosen parts manufacturer Largan to make the periscope lens for the iPhone 15 Pro Max. McCroomers now report that this new periscope camera, which would be built into the telephoto lens, could offer 5x6x optical zoom, which is almost double the 3x zoom offered by the current iPhone 14 Pro Max. It is an exclusive feature that will be limited to the iPhone 15 Pro Max only, according to reports. While there has been no substantial leak about the pricing of the iPhone 15 Pro Max, Apple could hike the price of the iPhone 15 Pro models, expanding the gap with the iPhone 15 Plus, according to reports. Apple could increase the price of its flagship model by as much as $200. According to a report by Forbes, Leaks Apple Pro states that the iPhone 15 Ultra will have a starting price as high as $1,299, a $200 increase on the iPhone 14 Pro Max and the biggest single generational jump in iPhone history. Meanwhile, a report on the Chinese platform claims that Apple could increase the price by $100, but only in the US to bring the price at par with other regions. Going by this rumor, the iPhone 15 Pro Max is expected to come with a starting price tag of $1,299 and can potentially rise as high as $1,799 for the 1TB model. Anyhow, thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe. Peace out.